Welcome back. Our next guest is really all about bringing people together. During the pandemic, he gathered stories from his online audience and created a book called One Page Comic Extravaganza. Let's meet the author, Christopher Runciman. Hello, Christopher, and welcome to the show. Hi, how are you today? I'm well, how are you? I'm great. Thanks for having me on the show. No problem. So tell us about this very unique book that you have authored. It's called One Page Comic Extravaganza. Yeah, it's uh, I've, since the start of COVID, uh, I have been, and, and when all the lockdowns began, uh, I have been opening up through social media to anybody that follows me that if they have a one page comic idea they would like to suggest, I'll do it. I'll write it and draw it and letter it and, and color it and do all the little fiddly bits for it. And uh, a, a lot of it came from, I was working as a manager at a bookstore and, and a lot of our, our people would get isolated. And then there's other people that we know in our lives that get isolated. Uh, and especially in a pandemic when they're not allowed to move around. So if this is a way to engage them with, with things and, and explore having fun again and, and interacting with each other, um, that's where it came from initially. And, uh, and sometimes smaller packeted things like a one page story is a, an easier way to go to just have a moment. And, and so we started with that. Uh, we've done uh, 96 now. Uh, since uh, since the first lockdown started in May of 2020? 2020. 2020. Yeah. <laughs> <Time disappears. laughs> it's all a blur. It's like <laughs> so, so it's a lot of fun and there's diverse ideas and, it, and it's you know it's been really engaging to be able to do it with people. So we're just collecting them now into book forms. Can you share some of the ideas that people have sent to you? They're out there. There's some fun ones. Um, <laughs> One page is uh, Nicholas Cage dressed up as the queen, giving a queen's address on, on the pandemic. Uh, there's uh, another page, of, uh, there's a, a short here on uh, two sloths prepared to engage in a sword fight. And so it's actually, the sloths never actually get to the sword fight because uh, they fall asleep, they're sloths. Uh, Jerry Seinfeld, a comedian, is forced to become the one thing he hates, a clown. And so Jerry Seinfeld is surgically altered into big feet and big nose clown. Um, still Jerry Seinfeld, like it's a cat lady, but the way we do it is it's a, a, a cat person who collects little ladies, you know, <laughs> so it's, it's a lot of silly ideas and a lot of different things to explore. And then there's a couple little horror stories or taking horror aesthetics and looking at them because I have a silly point of view uh, the Frankenstein monster goes to kindergarten is one like it's just it's whatever it comes across um, my desk or comes you know and suggested by people in social media we're still doing them we just did this it's a uh, bad luck bill it's about a, a gambler an old cowboy who um has a, a horse that's lame and won't let him ride it. And he gets a, a, a one-eyed pig wearing a tutu and he talks to the animals. And as all these mad ideas come across from people, I'm open to it because it's all about engagement. You know, it's all right. about the interaction. So how can people become involved in this? Because this sounds extremely interesting. <laughs> it's different for sure. Um, yes. it's, it's on my social media on Instagram and on uh, Christopher Runciman Canada is where I'm doing it there or Runciman Runciman on Facebook uh, and it's literally I just turn on the camera in the studio and say let's go you know if I'm working on a page for for one of the publishers that I'm working for um, or if I'm working on or, or, or if I'm open to let's do a, a one page which I always am uh, that's that's it. People just start typing. What's your crazy idea? And as long as it's nothing too, you know, dark or 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 off putting, yeah, of course we're into it. Because you know, I think I've only ever really gotten fun suggestions and great suggestions and stuff, and no one's been odd yet. But it's it's fun and it's exploring different materials and going for it. Well, this is so amazing. What a wonderful way to keep people engaged 
during a time where a lot of people felt extremely isolated. So, so thank you for that, Christopher. Thank you. Mm -hmm.